Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Holly. Today I'm gonna to be planning the week of March 6th in my Erin Condren planner. The kit I'm gonna be using is this kit that I just picked up from Planner Bell Press. I will include the haul linked below where I shared this kit. And honestly, I was not planning, I normally like pre-plan the kits I'm gonna use and I was planning on doing a Frozen themed spread for this week, but number one, when I got this, it was so pretty. But number two, it's like not frozen weather. I thought I'd be able to use my winter kits into like mid-March because normally where I live, honestly, we get like some of our biggest snowstorms historically have been in March. And so I thought I'd be able to use them, but it's been like really nice and sunny and it like, it's not that warm out, but, um, definitely not like frozen themed. So had to call it audible and decided to use this kit instead. So I am going to get started with the bottom washi, but I think I'm gonna do something different and cut this down a little because it is a lot of glitter and it's just kind of like plain glitter. And I kind of want to extend the spread a little. We're gonna see. I feel I've been very playful with my Erin Condren formats recently. And so what I'm gonna do is just take this, try to see where the seam is, and maybe just cut like a little bit off. So it is actually, it's already not, it's not like crazy thick, but I think I still wanna cut a little bit off. So I'm gonna go ahead and do that with my X-Acto blade. Okay, we'll see if I was able to do that evenly or not, uh, TBD. So I'm gonna put these down here and try this. Oh, the other thing I wanted to mention is that Planner Bell Press, actually Alyssa, the shop owner, actually sent me a coupon code to share with you guys. So um, I will have that listed down below. It is Holly Plans 25. It's, oh, oh, oops. Oh shit. I forgot that there were just like normal strips of washi in addition to the bottom washi. Oh gosh, what did I do? Oh, it's flags? I might've cut the flags. Oh shit. There were like flags here um, that like I totally just cut because I kind of just went automatically. I forgot that like half of the bottom washi was shorter. Well, anyway, for future reference, if you ever get one of her kits, there are <laughs> secret hidden flags there. <laughs> so, oops. Um, anyway, um, the code is HOLLYPLANS25, 25% 25 off um, your order. And she's like already really affordable. So like, I, I yeah, she's really, she's definitely a really good option if you um, are not like typically one that uh, you know, feels like sticker kits are a little too pricey for your budget. I, this is a little thicker than that, but we're gonna call it fine. So I think how I wanna do this is I'm debating whether I want to do the uh, full boxes at the top or the bottom. Or where, where are we working with here? Where are our full boxes? So we have these beautiful full boxes that I really don't want to cover up that much because they're so pretty. So I think what I'm going to do is do my bottom boxes down here and put them down a little bit farther then do like kind of my today section in the middle and that'll be a little bit bigger. I'll just have to cover up that bar and then my to do's at the top. I think that is how I'm gonna do it. And I'm gonna use these for my to do's because obviously they are gorgeous. So first I'm gonna do these bottom boxes at the bottom and I think I will use, debating whether I wanna use this or this girl. I only really want one girl and, and I wanna do the quote box up top So I think I'll do, I'll do these two girls down here and I'll do these in the middle and I'm gonna bring these right down to this line that's here just as like a, to know where to put them. And I think that'll be good. And so I'm just gonna kind of space these out just in ways that I think looks nice. Okay, I uh, put those down and I think I'm going to go ahead and actually skip the headers because I don't think I want to put anything in there. I don't have that many little things this week. I just have a few TV shows and I 
And that's really, oh, and it's like payday. I'm like looking at my little pre-planning list here. I have like a few TV shows, it's payday, but I don't have any bills. So I, and I don't really have a ton, ton of regular plans. So I think I'm going to go ahead and just have a bigger today section and just not put any headers there. Um, and just kind of let them stand as deco. You guys normally, or you know I normally like to use my full boxes as a, as, wow, that, that my, uh, my accent is coming through here, as a uh, area to write uh, in little things, because I do feel like I normally need the space, but I think this week I'll be able to get away with just leaving them decorative. Next, I do want to go ahead and put my meal little things down and in my haul I did note that she kind of has like a weird thing going on with her little things where the like six of them are one color and then one's another color so I'm just going to put that particular color here and I'm going to use these little things to cover up that bar there um and do it this way you can kind of see the bar. I wonder if it'll show up on camera. In person, at least, you can kind of see the bar showing through, but I think that is fine. Oh, and so the reason, one of the reasons I also wanted to use this kit this week is, spoiler alert, I do have coming up on my channel, I'm kind of like preparing, starting to make lists and organizing for a like favorite Etsy shops video. And I honestly, like when I first ordered from Planner Bell Press, I um, was like, oh my God, this stuff is amazing. Like, I, especially because I really like to be able to recommend to you guys some shops that are more affordable. You like, you guys know I love Scribble Prints Co. and Planner Gems and some, you know, but I, I realized that they're not in the price range for everybody, especially to do for a kit every week. But Planner Bell Press is super affordable, but I, I feel like I can't recommend a shop if I haven't even like used her kit yet. I am using her monthly kit this month as well, but um, but like I, you know, I can't, even though I've bought from her, I, I can't really recommend um, even as a budget option unless I've used her kit. So I did wanna test this out for that purposes as well. But the reason I'm bringing this up, so I do notice some of her like cuts are just a little sticky. Like it's fine. I don't know if you could just see that, but you just have to yank it a little. Um, nothing that like I would consider a misfit, uh, but just a note. Anyway. Uh, the the reason I'm bringing this up is because I wanted to ask you guys what your thoughts were on whether I should be doing that as a like one gigantically long video, like I'm talking at least an hour, or should it be a couple of videos over the course of a week? So I'm kind of having a hard time deciding how to do it. So I wanted to know what your opinions are. Like, do you prefer like longer video and you can kind of come back to it when you have time or would you rather do like a couple of shorter videos so I would do one that's like top 10 shops and like another one that's like best shops for functional video functional stickers and budget shops and then another one that's just planner accessories so I guess that was that's my question would you rather see it over like over the course of three videos or just like one really really long video so let me know down below that that same question applies for like my sticker organization and sticker and desk storage video um, although I think I could make that one short enough to just be one like reasonably length video but both of those videos I know they're like very highly requested they are going to come up in this month debating whether I want to leave the March showing or not what do I want to put in the sidebar I kind of want to do the top three I kind of want to maybe use this for my videos and or do I want to put my videos in the week I like the March. I like. I think it actually looks nice with this kit, but since I am going to be using date covers that came with this kit, I think I'll go ahead and cover it up and put this up here closer to the top. So anyway, those videos are coming up like hopefully this month, probably towards the end of the month if I'm being honest, um, but I am trying to get those up for you guys because I really, I, I honestly, I think they'll be fun to make and I know they are highly requested, so. Those are on their way. Let me know if you have thoughts down below about how to, um, or like how to organize those. And I think I'm gonna just put a little piece of washi. I don't feel like I need a header for my habit trackers. What headers do we have? We have, I, I could use a goals header. I think that's good. And so I'm gonna take a piece of washi if I could find it. Um, 
Oh, off to the side and take a piece of washi here. And then I'm also gonna take, I thought these little lists she had were really cute. I'm gonna take this top three list and use that as well under the goals section. And then I also wanna make sure that I do my videos, I think, or do I just want, do I have room for videos and a heart checklist? No, no I don't. Oh, I could use another one of these mini ones and just put a header, yeah, I'll do that. Um, so I think I'm gonna take that next actually because I don't wanna put the two gray ones next to each other. So I'm gonna take another piece of washi. I can't believe I destroyed those flags by the way. I don't think they, they, they're way too big to be the flags for the upper corner. So I guess at least I didn't destroy those, but I don't know if she has those. Um, but still, like, what is wrong with me? Just went right over it. And then maybe another piece of washi. Let's make sure we have space for this though. Take this, put this down here. Yeah, we have space for some washi, I think. Oh, 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 maybe not, maybe not. Uh, I'm gonna cut this just a little. Okay, things ended up a little crooked, but I think we're fine. So I'm gonna take a header now, and we don't have a this week or a YouTube one or something like that. What do we have? To buy, next week, spending, to go. So none of those are great. So what do we have over here? Could I just take like a YouTube icon? I could just take this icon and this will work. So that is very cute, a very functional sidebar. So now in my days, I don't need to put my videos because I put those here. I already have my meals down, looking a little weird with the headers behind it, but we'll survive. And so next I'm gonna do the to-dos so that I know kind of where to put the headers and everything. I'm debating whether I wanted to bring those up, but I don't really think I need the space looking at. So I think I'm just gonna go ahead and put the to-dos in the normal spot. And how do we wanna order this? I think I'm gonna go, I think I'll do pink in the middle cause I have that pink meal little thing. So I'm gonna go through and lay these down. Oh, and I did wanna mention like one final thing. I feel horrible that I have been terrible at doing comments lately. And I just wanna apologize to you guys. I really do like read them, most of them, Sometimes YouTube is weird and some of them don't come to my email, but for the most part, they do come to my email. And so that's why you'll often see me, like if there's something that's like an issue, like sometimes, like Sandy, thank you very much for this. One time like pointed out like, your title's wrong. Like, cause I had something like screwed up in my title card or whatever they call it, thumbnail. And um, so I, you know, I, so I do, if something's like wrong or something like that, I will respond quickly, but I feel bad that I don't respond to like all the other stuff. And I try to get to like any specific questions. I really do love hearing from you guys. So please don't take this as like a stop messaging me. Um, Cause it's not like that at all. I really want to get back into a habit where I'm like doing comments daily. It's just been like a little busy lately, especially at work, which is, I like to use it. It's like a nice thing to do in downtime at work. But if I don't have that much of that, um, it's like a little harder to fit in. So I apologize very much for that because I do love hearing from you guys and I don't want you to feel like I'm not responding. Anyway, I think those are all the, like, the little bits I said to myself, don't forget to mention. So, oh, the other thing, sorry about my thumb. God, it's been a really stressful week at work. I have a terrible habit of biting. Like it's really gross, don't, don't ask, but, um, so I, yeah, so that's like destroyed right now. So I also did not paint my nails cause yeah, I mean, you can't, can't dress that up. That's just not, not looking cute. So I'm gonna go through and lay these down with the headers as well. Uh oh, guys, I should have put the purple in the middle cause I only have one purple to do. So I'm gonna switch these so that they match because obviously. Oh God. 
I should get them due out, but I'm being lazy. Okay, so we have those to-do headers down and fix the checklist. And I think instead of doing a today header, I'm gonna get crazy here, guys. I think I wanna do glitter headers. And I kinda wanna vary them to match the checklist. Since we have all of these, they came with the kit, why not use them to cover this? Just cause we do have this glitter down at the bottom. So I think it's kind of, I don't know. We're going, I guess I'm team glitter now. No, I'm not, I'm really not. But I do think it looks nice sometimes. Okay, and I think we have most of the base down. I think before I go in with my today section, I will go ahead and do these date covers um, and just get those down so that it doesn't um, visually bother me as much. And I think I'm gonna go ahead and, so I don't think I saw in her kits the little flags for the top corner. I don't think so. I'm like making sure she has these flags, but they're a lot bigger. So I think I'm just gonna cut some washi down to fit that spot and do that. Actually, you know what I think would look cuter than just doing this? I think I'm gonna take those like flags I destroyed and turn those into little, cause then it'll kind of echo the glitter down there. We're gonna do that. Okay, so we have those flags down in the date covers. Is it driving me insane visually that some of these match and some of them don't? Yes. Is that because I'm crazy? 100%. So we're just gonna let it go. Now we're gonna do the today section, which is also gonna kind of be a combined little things section um, for any like TV shows and stuff I have. But let's go ahead and get started. I will, um, start on Monday. Monday morning I want to go for a run. I love that she has these like little things here. I'm going to use those for like shorter workouts. If it's like a really hard workout or something like that, I do enjoy giving myself a half box, but um, these are really cute, so I might as well use them. So doing that, and then on Monday night I want to really get a lot of YouTube done, and I am going to take just a half box here from the kit. And I think I will take one of these printed ones and put that in. And then take one of these little laptops and just layer that over it. Very cute. And then on to Tuesday. Tuesday, I wanna go to yoga in the morning, which totally deserves a half box because getting up early is hard. So I'm gonna take this half box and layer that and take this workout sticker. This is really cute. I wonder if she sells this in multicolor because obviously I would need it. So I don't love this like half box thing with like the stuff written on it. I just find that like a little, it's kind of hard to cover up. So I'm gonna lift that up, save that for later. And instead I'll take, and I think instead I will take the pink, I guess, even though we already have a lot of pink in that zone. Okay, maybe there's a way we can cover up the remember. Let's see what we can do here. I'm just gonna take like a little strip of this glitter and kind of almost use it as if it's like a background to the sticker, but also just cover up that remember. Yeah, that works. And then I can write in the details there. And then on Wednesday, I don't really have much plan. I'm gonna take a rest day. So I'm gonna take this lazy day sticker and put that towards the beginning. Oh, and then on Tuesday night, sorry, I totally just like skipped ahead. I do have a TV show and I want to plan on spending some time with my husband. We're going to like watch that and 
that'll just kind of be like I, I think I mentioned in like a plan as I go spread we're trying to like designate like one night a week that's more like our night so um this will be that so I'll just put, put that down and also maybe take like a little heart next to it to note that it's like with my husband. And then on Wednesday, like I said, not too much going on. Not sure what I'm gonna have to do at that point. I am traveling for work on Thursday. I don't know, it really depends on how much YouTube I have left to get done. Um, so I'm just gonna leave that space blank for now. Thursday, like I said, I'm basically just doing a day trip, which is just kind of rough. Like I have to drive like three hours, get up at like the butt crack of dawn to do that. So I'm gonna take a little thing in the morning to note down getting up real, real early. And for that, I'm going to grab an exclamation point to cover that. Little symbol there. And write that, getting it that up real early. And then I'm going to take a coffee cup and maybe like a laptop to note down work meetings that day. We just have to like go down for a presentation and then drive back. So kind of rough, to be honest. Um, so noting that, and I'll just write those in next to it just to have like a little bit more white space. And oh, you know what I wanna do instead of this exclamation point? I'm gonna pull this up. I kinda wanna take this cute little don't forget thing she has over here. I don't think I have like another good use case for it. So I think I'm gonna, put that there. Yeah, that's really cute. Um, and then because I do get to drive back like after lunch that day, and then I'll work from home for the rest of the day, I should be able to run in the afternoon, which is nice. I really prefer running in the afternoon if I can, as opposed to the morning. So I'm going to go ahead and do that. So I'm going to put that there to note that down. And that just looks like too many little things stacked, especially since they're the same color. So I'm going to switch this and grab her little workout icon and just put that on that so it doesn't look quite the same. And I'm also going to take this little car icon and put that here to note to like, because that is a drive. Although I don't like how that's covering the glitter header, eh, it's fine. Um, okay, so then on to Friday. So I kind of go down and come back uh, all in the same day on Thursday. Friday is a normal work day. Um, oh, I do wanna take this recycling and put that in the to-do list so I don't forget to do that on Thursday night because we do need to take out the recycling and the trash. And then Friday, I should work out during that day. Um, I'm not sure if it'll be a spin class or a run. Um, I'm gonna take another one of these little little things. I'm really jamming on these, these are nice. Um, and, cause they're like chunkier, they're not, if it was the normal size of like a little thing, this wouldn't be good because it's like not thick enough to really write in or like to take up enough space to like signify, I'm doing a workout, but um, I, like these, these are good. Although I wanna use the same one again on Sunday or Saturday. So should I do, maybe I'll just do something different on Friday just to change it up a little. Um, and I'll put this, I'm gonna go put this on Saturday before I forget. And then, so I will take, I'll just take a quarter box um, in the morning on Friday. I'm not sure if I'm gonna go to a spin class or go for a run yet, so. I'm gonna take, I'm gonna take these cute little sneakers from Planner Gems. I'm gonna grab this little light purple one and just put that here, just for something a little bit different. And I will then, on Friday and Saturday, I'm not totally sure what I'm doing. One night I think will probably be like a date night, going out to dinner with my husband. The other night will be a me time. 
So I think for now, I'm just going to leave it blank. I have this really cute me time sticker and then I do have obviously half boxes left. So, and like the cute date night sticker. So I will come back and like fill those in, but I um, probably will just leave those blank for now. I also do want to add a payday sticker. Maybe I'll just put that down at the bottom over top of some washi. And so then I'll leave that space blank for whatever I end up doing. Um, I will post a picture of the finished spread or at least the second half of the finished spread on Instagram. So definitely follow me there if you're curious what it will look like once it's all filled in. And then on to... Oh, I do have a TV show on Thursday, Scandal, but I'm not going to sit down and watch it, especially after that long day, so I guess I'll just leave it blank. Um, and then, sorry, on to Saturday, workout in the morning. Then we definitely need to get groceries. So I'm going to go ahead and just put this like this. Or I'll just put it in the middle. And then I will leave space for whatever we decide to do that night. So I'll leave that blank for now. And then on to Sunday. Sunday I'm hosting my friend over for brunch. Um, so that's kind of why I wanted to get all these, all five of my workouts done before Sunday. Normally Sunday I do like to get a workout in, but not if I have other things to do. So Sunday I'm hosting my friend over for brunch and we are going to be doing like some planner crafts. So we're going to be making paper clips and maybe tassels. And I think we're going to try and film it. So that'll be really fun. So definitely subscribe to see that next week. Um, she she has a happy planner. I, she's like the one I got really into stickers and stuff. So I am excited to do this with her. So we will do that. So I'm going to put that there. And also maybe take this little house sticker. Because I am hosting. And then the rest of the day, I really should do... Oh, this is spring forward. Hold on. Hold on. We need to... I'm going to just take this exclamation point and just put that right at the top. I'm not even going to take a little thing because I just feel like I have little things across the top of every day. Um, but yeah, need to note that down. And I probably will for the rest of the day also get some of my own filming done, but I don't think I'm gonna put, I don't really have room here and I can just write in what I wanna film up there. I do wanna note down though to get some laundry done. So I'll just put that here like that. And so I think that is everything I need to note down. Like I said, Friday, Saturday, I probably will come, and Wednesday even, I will come back and add some things in. Um, I did not use the weekend banner to the probably surprise of nobody. I totally forgot. So um, I'm just going to leave it. We'll just, we don't need the weekend banner. Uh, and then finally, I do have some deco. This girl is really pretty, but I don't know if I feel like I have space for her. Could she go over here? Oh, maybe. Let's do this. Okay, that is nice. And then we do have just a couple of pieces of deco, but I don't feel like these need to be incorporated as much. So I'm gonna go ahead and fill this out and come back and show you guys what it looks like all done. Okay guys, so I am all filled in here. I love how this turned out. Like I just really, really am feeling these like muted purples, the muted pinks. I just love this color combination. And for me, this is just the right amount of glitter. I think any more would have been a little too much. And as it is, it's already really busy, but I think this white space chunk in the middle really helps to break it up. And then we do have this nice strip of white space and the simple date headers at the top to kind of balance out these busier checklists. So I really liked this. I think the Planner Bell press kits are a great option if you're a budget planner, like I've said 57 times. And even if you're not a budget planner, they're really pretty kits and they're super functional. So let's, I like, I barely pulled in. I pulled in like one other sticker. Um, I mean, for me, the main thing I typically pull in is stuff for my workouts. And just the fact that she had these little things and some other workout stickers meant I really didn't have to pull in as many of those. So that's just kind of the way I plan. But also like the other thing I sometimes pull in is like girls night or wine time stuff. And she did have like a wine sticker there. She had a couple of planners. So yeah, she has like a really good variety. So let's look at what we do have left. So I have all of these checklists and a lot of the 
functional deco left. I will probably pull in some of these by the end of the week though. So um, just have some icons. And the headers, I did do something really different this week and I didn't use my Today and Extra Bits headers. And honestly, I don't think I miss them. Um, I forgot to mention this was a little bit inspired by uh, Gabby from GP Sticker Studio. She had a great plan with me last week that was featuring a planner gems kit. And she did something kind of similar to this where she did, um, she didn't do like a header, what did she do? I think she like didn't do, she did something like this where she kind of just covered up this header and didn't use a header. So that was, I forgot to mention that that was my inspiration for that. But anyway, I do have these headers left and then some um, little things. Oh, I do have a TV show on Sunday. See, we don't have room for everything. That's a problem. Oh well. Uh, Should we just put this up here? And then instead of taking a little thing, because I do feel like it's a little crowded, I'm gonna take this little TV here. Because I do wanna actually watch this. I've been watching Big Little Lies and I do wanna sit down and watch this. So, if I can. Okay, so that is good, and so, oh well. If I had thought about that, I probably would have skipped the half box and done a little thing, but whatever. So anyway, little things, headers left, some half boxes, a lot of quarter boxes. I didn't use the weekend banner, just happened to not have any bills due this week, um, and the flags and teardrops. Have another set of date headers. I, um, I don't know, if I use this kit again, I could use those. I don't typically track my hydration in this planner, so I didn't use that, and just, a few deco pieces, a lot of the printed washi, and then some of these extra strips that I cut off from the bottom washi. A lot of date, or uh, what are these called? Glitter headers, very nice. Um, one regular checklist and one full box. So definitely could do like a little personal spread with this if I wanted to. I'm not sure, like you guys know, I do have a lot of kits, so I'm not sure if I'll get around to it anytime soon, but I probably will hang on to those. And yeah, that is it for this spread. Let me know what you guys thought. I've really been enjoying playing around with different formats and trying to figure out what works for me, especially just like playing around week to week, you know, like this week's a little bit different than last week was. So I don't have quite as many, you know, personal events going on. So it just makes a little bit more sense to change it up. So anyway, let me know down below what you guys thought. Let me know what you guys thought about those questions at the beginning about kind of the length of videos for stuff upcoming. And give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it and subscribe if you want to see more planner videos or if you want to see those videos I have coming up. So thank you guys so much for watching and I'll be back soon with another video. Bye!